Live from the part of Austin where the people enjoy seeing fun Jets butt stuff shenanigans, it's going to be a great night. Now, lament that Flea is the new Keith Richards, and be careful because our friend is very vengeful. Here are your hosts, Brian Brushwood and Justin Robert Young. Uh, this is important. Technically, we're in a recess. And, we are. And and I, I, I know that you paid a lot of money yeah. because you want the best defense you can get. I can, and I will. But I we can agree it. it's a pretty egregious crime. Yep. So, I have a pitch. Go. I want you to, starting now, affect an accent and walk right in talk to those judges and explain yourself okay oh okay all right doors open Can I, wait hold on wait, wait, wait. oh pa- sorry pa- hold pa- pa- doors pa- closed pa- doors pa- closed pa- sorry your honor sorry your honor yeah sorry hold on wait a minute yeah. um this is about my drinking isn't it no 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 this is all, this is all the, uh, no no i i just wanted like the retainer cover no no because i need a little inspiration okay so uh i'm gonna need a job i'm, I'm needing not- a job i'm gonna listen for a job who has a job uh, who has a job? Who has a job? I heard Dennis. Uh, okay. Uh, 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 so uh, 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 and now, and now, now you want you wanted you wanted a accent. Well, looking for an accent. Looking for an accent. Uh, looking for an accent. Uh, who has an accent? Dennis who has an accent. Who has an accent? Jamaican. I'm hearing. Jamaican. Jamaican dentist. It's just the two of us outside yeah. in yeah. there. You you do realize that there's an actual crime that you committed, and I'm trying to defend you against this. Yeah, man. <laughs> Have you lost? <laughs> okay. Yeah, uh, now, now I know I, I know we're trying to shake things up here, but it seems like you're really diving in on this. I read, <laughs> rinse and spit, boy. Oh, uh, uh, you know what? I'm starting to think this wasn't a great idea. I know I'm drinking on the job. I know I've technically been disbarred, <laughs> but uh, but but if you feel good about this, let's. Uh, uh, I'm gonna open the doors for you, and in you go. This has been a total disaster. <laughs> wait, wait, what do you mean? I and just... in and in summation. Bumba clot! <laughs> Go see the front desk to schedule your next appointment! <laughs> I don't know what that is. Okay. And see! All right. Anyway, he died in prison. <laughs> How's your week, bud? Man, it's been just, just leisurely. spending your time in Austin. Just, I, just take it or easy. I've been doing so much shit. Just enjoy so much shit, man. I was hanging in... out doing Patreon bonus episodes with me and Brett. Oh, I haven't done one in two weeks, and we're not gonna do one together this week. What? Why not? Because we're gonna do one. Oh yeah, on the road. Yeah. Uh, uh, but yeah, no, everything's been. I've been traveling a lot. I was in Savannah. Do you, Do you remember? I'm gonna speak in code so that only yeah. long time. Listeners will understand this. Yeah. Remember when we were really excited to go to Philadelphia, and, we, and then suddenly we never talked about why we were excited. Yep. Three, four. We're going to Washington D.C. tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> ah, who knows? What, and what for? What? What? Where are you going for? Uh. The, the you listen here, man. <laughs> Black is a real menace. Uh, I mean, that's all good, right? We're going to have a good time. Yeah, it's more travel. Holy fuck, man. I'm traveling a lot. We're going to be I in went, the I went, sky. I went, I, went, I went to Minneapolis, St. Paul to meet with a bunch of secret society British people. <laughs> I went to fucking Savannah so I could not be let in to the goddamn... <laughs> To the goddamn Georgia debate. I roll up. In fact, there was this moment, and, and I I was going to text you if it were successful, mm-hmm. but it was not. But uh, but uh, I see. So I'm on a waiting list for PX3 to go cover the Raphael Warnock Herschel Walker debate in Savannah, Georgia. And oh, I have how? I have a hotel. Like, you almost were there. I was literally right Outside. next to the thing. But I don't have an official credential. I am waitlisted for a credential. So wait a minute. Why didn't you just bust out like a fake ass badge? <laughs> because everything is very locked down for this shit. Uh, but but that. no 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 no. Hold on hold on hold on. So I'm I'm walking by and I think that like I I'm kind of like a 
assuming that I'm not getting in. So I'm just going to do a little walk before I do a live stream. And I see there's this totally unguarded media entrance. And I'm like, if there's one thing that Brian would tell me to do. Oh, yes. Is go back to my hotel. Yes. Get myself looking exactly like I should be in there. Put on my suit jacket. Mm -hmm. Walk up. And just be like, hi, guys. Guys, great to be here. Great to be here. So I go. Yeah. Get all my accoutrement ready. I walk my uh, hot ass down uh, uh, to, <laughs> to, to, the, to that media gate. And as I am, as I am just like that, 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 that keep stepping. Like, yeah. like keep guy. on trucking yeah. straight from the 70s. Oh, yeah. With yeah. That foot, foot just out. big <laughs> yeah. foot. Like gigantic <laughs> steps I am taking. Uh, two gigantic fucking security guards and they're very nice but there's a velvet rope and there's a lady with a list and i go uh i walk up very confidently hey man what's up hey what's going on <laughs> hey, there it is there yeah. it is <laughs> that's what i look like and i'm like like great weather we're having beautiful facility amazing justin robert young politics 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 <laughs> and just let it hang yeah because I know I'm waitlisted, so maybe oh, yeah. I'm on a list somewhere that they will find. But I, I'm, I know I'm definitely not on the on the primary list. And she's like, "Okay, let me go look." Flip, 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 flip. And I know it's not there, so I'm like, I'm now distracting the security guards because yeah. I want them on my side. And I'm like, "Boy, man, <laughs> this weather, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. the sun, <laughs> the clouds, this is wild." Yeah. Uh, you ever played the game Sorry? I've never experienced any kind of apologetic vibes during that game. It seems like everyone's a real piece of shit. Uh, uh, and then they go, uh, that's what? And I'm like, uh, politics, politics, politics. That's not politico, is it? And I'm oh, like, you should have. Might be. Uh, nah, no, because that, 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 that's some shit that will actually get me like arrested if I, if I false, if I like, like say that I'm somebody else. Yeah, if you, if you confess there. to being uh, or imply that you're Hispanic. <laughs> yep. Sorry. I, I would try. Yeah, we can erase things on the internet. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, Jeff sure. has collapsed. Yep. <laughs> Politico. Did you say Hispanic? <laughs> I was I was running on the fly. I didn't have a lot of time. <laughs> I'm just glad Jeff found it funny. All right, he died. H H E S. <laughs> Enter. <laughs> I can't even work the camera at them. Okay. So anyway, hello. <laughs> yes, I'm Hez. Hez, Hispanic. So, how did you handle? So they go, "Are you political?" No, 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 I'm not political. I, I, and, and so then I'm like, uh, uh, "I was on a wait list. I was told that I should come here uh, uh, on the day of to see whether." As or not you're I saying was all this, and again, very proud of you. You full well know. This is all. I'm fucked. Yeah, I'm totally. And at this point, I'm literally. You might as just, well have said, you're just starting... Robert Young, Bonnie's Paradise. Yeah, basically. <laughs> I mean, like, like so uh, I'm, I'm hoping that there is somebody there with authority. Because normally with political events, if you're there and you say you're from out of state and you have equipment and you're like, I'm trying to cover this, like, I, I'm not here to record a bts concert right like i am here to cover a civic event that theoretically should be distributed as far and wide as possible with the understanding with these events the campaign's got to approve certain things i just need somebody in charge to say yes the person with the podcast that flew on their own dime to another state to cover this is somebody that should be in there and have access to this as opposed to the seven political reporters that are all going to write the same thing back and forth contest in georgia that nobody's gonna fucking read. so in your mind you've got the many worlds theory where anything that can happen must happen in some timeline and you're hoping somebody in charge says what are you doing get out of here let the nice hispanic man in yes exactly okay. uh, he's from hell, hell is so spanicking right now <laughs> uh, uh, i'm just uh, gonna i'm gonna go back again uh, you know, we're, here now. Worse. we're right. here now yeah uh, 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 so anyway, I, I was, I was denied and then I just live streamed and it was fine. Okay. How do you, 
I never, I still don't know how to land it when it fails. I have, I only report the stories where it works. How did you land it once it was very clear they were not going to let you in? You know that, that keep trucking? Yep. Side? <laughs> <laughs> and I just walked just as confidently right the fuck on out. They're like, uh, uh, the, the, the literal thing was, uh, uh, yeah, you haven't been cleared, so you cannot walk past that rope. Huh. Literally the words that I was said. And I said, hey, thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> and I just walked the fuck right back to my hotel. This is my favorite part of every episode where we ask Bryce for a story. And I know technically we all meet beforehand and tell him what stories to queue up. Yeah. In this moment, I have you no idea. Shit. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Bryce, do you have a story for us? Uh, yeah. Here's our next topic. Whole foods, whole lot of BS. This is the moment where I think, do I know what this is about? No, I do not. And I look to Justin and hope. Fucking God that he knows. I do. Although it wasn't Whole Foods. It was Central Market. Uh, <laughs> Wait a that's throw? Fine. I don't know. If it, I, 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 yeah, no, no, I don't know. Wow. If it was, I, I don't know if wow. it was a me problem or a Bryce problem. That was a real Hez move. <laughs> wow. Kind of worse. Kind of worse a little. <laughs> it's kind of getting worse. <laughs> and to be fair, I want to see how far it goes. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to say you're bullying him, but if I was to describe as bull. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it's a cluster bomb. Mm. Yeah. It's Fun. attacking more ethnicities. Mm. Uh, I go to Central Market. Central Market, for people who are not from Austin, is basically Whole Foods, but laid out like an Ikea. It's fancy. <laughs> it's, a, it's fancy H-E-B, but the one by me is literally laid out like, a, like, like an Ikea, so you have to walk through every, every, everything. Oh, but, but imagine you can eat all the furniture. Anyway, I walk into the, <laughs> I walk into the central market, and this is, as Brian has pointed out, I've been on the road a lot. Yes. This was literally the day after I got back. I have about 24 hours to do the things that I would normally do over a week. And so I have to make a lot of trips to a lot of different places. I see Central Market. Quick question. Yeah. Just a little. Is this before or after the brief window where you thought you had a whole week at home, but then realized that you and I are going to Washington, D.C. tomorrow? Right afterward. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. Right afterward. No, there was a moment where I got back from Savannah that I thought I had a week before we did the D.C. trip. Right. And I was like, oh, boy. Well, what a, what, a, what a great week I had to decompress before more travel. And then I looked on my calendar. And I was like, I just a very loud Fuck! <laughs> uh, followed by a phone call to me, like, "Hey, hey, how's it going?" Um, you know, I'm just, I'm just double checking right now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> is, is, is that this week? And I'm like, "Yeah, man, I, I got the flights, I got the hotel, I got the rental car, I got the, yeah, okay, I just, I just thought, don't worry, <laughs> everything's fine. I just called you for no reason. Ha ha ha! What a great classic prank by me, Justin, your friend. I'm gonna go. I don't know. Anyway, bye. So literally, the next thing I do is go to Central Market, and all I see at Central Market is when you right walk in, and again, it's laid out like an IKEA. So the, everything that you see is on purpose. The first thing when you walk in, see our other locations, and a bunch of pictures. Of their other locations. Uh, what the fuck is up with that? Uh, what the fuck, man? I'm at your fucking location right now. Now look, if you put it at the end, after you've gone and you've and you've shopped and you've gotten your shit, maybe at the end. And if you put little things like, oh, we have crawdads here. <laughs> or like, we have glue traps uh, 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 up in this other place. Like, like we have different things. Like, like have a look, look, a, a, a Chinese lantern you can get at this location. I'd be like, fuck, okay, maybe I'll go from this location to another location because you have enticed me but not at the moment where i've just committed not at the moment where i'm actually inside of you for the first time we are literally at just the tip and you're immediately <laughs> saying consider fucking my cousin <laughs> Art. Well, hold on, hold on. just give me 
<laughs> just a little bit. Maybe I'm overreacting. No, <laughs> no, I think that's a smart. <sighs> I think you got the right tack of it, Justin. Red. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I, I, I'll now We're take taking questions. questions. Now I'm taking I... questions. Are you sure? Because I don't know your proclivities, but are you sure you didn't go in the back door? Are you sure? Uh, well, first you of all, could have gone okay, into okay. the back door. Uh, 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 yeah, uh, uh, I got this one. Uh, 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 yeah. Your Honor, this is preposterous because the only people coming in the back door should be employees. And what company would tell employees to go see their other location? But and also, and also, the answer is no. <laughs> and that's offensive. <laughs> and you know it. Fake news. Justin is a proud he's panic man. <laughs> he's <laughs> not even has. No, not he's not even gonna. We're fixing it. We're we're or he's we're leaving or it. He's Take it com. Taking it back. <laughs> uh, uh, anyway, I, I I I was I was very sensitive <laughs> on Sunday, and I had a reaction to that what, side. What that's is the most generous? steel manning of that justification somebody somewhere decided to put that sign up and then he had to explain to his boss why uh uh uh, uh curtis come over here uh now i see that you have placed here a sign yes. saying welcome to our food establishment Please oh actually no 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 we don't say that we literally just say visit our other location because <laughs> okay. we assume that's a, the the central market shopper, right? Knows they're welcome. Okay, Curdy. They know they're welcome yep. when our doors open and they see the mosquito shit we keep for most of the year, right to the left. <laughs> right. Okay. They know that that's that's the same smell as a warm apple pie at your grandmother's house. Okay, so at the central market. So we want to show them the galaxy of stars. So uh, let's let's table the fact that. Texas uh, apple pie t smells like citronella, but uh, it instead explain to me exactly how, how much. Does Hi, I'm Central Market Don <laughs> Draper. No, you're 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 the guy I'm talking to right now. Exactly. Yeah. We need to cut it on the characters that you keep going into. Okay. <laughs> Give me the best case scenario for what yeah. happens when somebody sees this sign wanting a, 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 a mocha frappuccino when they walk in. To the central market. Mm. And they see another central market. Yeah. We want them to say fuck. Okay. Uh, Pardon uh, my French. Okay. I'm in the wrong <laughs> fucking location. <laughs> well, I, I need to go to another location that's closer to where I live. <laughs> if they're in Round Rock, I want to think that they should go downtown. If they're downtown, <laughs> I want them to think they should go to East Austin. Yeah. If they're in East Austin, I want to think that they should go to Hutto. I want <laughs> everybody to think they are in the wrong location at all times. They're confused. They're like, I don't know where I am. Should I buy four melons and maybe two growlers? of craft beer this is a central market after all they're dazed they're confused they're legally impaired to drive they walk <laughs> out into their car and god knows what happens but we got the money <laughs> sweet green ever since the day we've hired you kurt dog i've not understood a word you've said but you've sold me hey I'm now being taken away by pirates. It's <laughs> <laughs> fun way to end the scene. Bryce, right? so what's our next topic? Our next topic. <laughs> Brian dug himself a hole. Oh boy! Oh, shit. Yeah, that was supposed to be the short uh, story. Th well, I, 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 this could go as long or as briefly as you want, but my goodness, my goodness. Um, uh, electricians, uh, they they be all like uh, zip zip zip. Right, right. Sometimes they're like, "Sir, uh, code states that you need to have a trench uh, 18 inches down between here and the electric meter." Because you are expanding stuff here on the property. That's right. You have added a new uh, a domicile, a new building. Yeah, new building, a, a prefab building that that'll be the home of Scam Stuff, and uh, we're very excited about it. We're having electricians make sure to put all the electrics in the right place and stuff, um, and. Uh, 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 <laughs> Even whatever, uh, but but we we gotta do uh, so 
I asked them, I was like, okay, so what? Uh, just dig a trench? And they're like, uh, yeah, I mean, they're, uh, how do I do that? You guys could do that? And they say, like, very clearly, this, this, like, everything has been jovial, but this sheen, and Jeff, you will attest to this, uh, uh, I, that wasn't a commandment. I, I think I'm right. Uh, but but all of a sudden, <laughs> not this like heaviness so comes you, you over did, them. You just ordered Jeff to do something. <laughs> no, a man no, is but, not but, but, on but, camera. I, I'm just saying, if I am right, please back me up on this. But but when the subject of the trench came up, they said, uh, well, to get it up to code, it's got to be 18 inches underground. And then pause. Everything gets dark. The clouds come out. And, yep. and then they yep. say, you... Uh, you don't want us to dig that trench. <laughs> and I was like, uh, I was like, oh, because uh, it's hard to contract somebody. I'm like, no, because we get paid two hundred dollars an hour, and we will dig that trench, and it will take as long as it takes us. Yeah. You don't. They're like, just go to home. Uh, if sun comes back out, it's like, just head on to some place, get a trencher. It'll be no big deal. Friday, boom, eight a.m. I'm up. I'm out. I'm like, so long. I'm gonna go get a trencher. Never rented a trencher. By the way, yeah. I mean, like. You are probably more of uh, 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 of a homeowner. You're certainly more of a homeowner than I am, right? I am only just now doing things where I have to realize, oh wait, shit, I can't call anybody to go fix this. You're more uh, 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 a man with your hands than than I am. But I will say this: not not but, by choice. But but whenever whenever I have to, boy, do you feel like a man, especially when you know that you have a project. Mm -hmm. Like like you're waking up, chef's kiss. Oh, dude, like look at me. I'm gonna be. Like my dad and uh, my uh, my wife's dad. The way you think of Bruce Springsteen, like like there's oh, just sure. it's just like like bright, like you're waking up and it's just like Brian Brushwood <laughs> waking <laughs> up, yeah. going Home Depot, go dig a trench now. <laughs> crank 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 my Jeep, <laughs> <laughs> driving <laughs> down. <laughs> He goes to torches. Can't do all the empty well, stuff. Hold on. Uh, Might as well uh, get a beer. I'm sorry, I ordered this with, 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 with no salt. Uh, okay. He's uh, watching the handsome man at Stephen A. Oh, hold on, I got Eventually he'll get to Ooh, Home Depot. I, I just hit platinum. <laughs> and then his day will begin. Oh, yeah, all right. Ah, well, it's good to see you, Logan. I bet. Oh, I, I guess I should close out. Hold on. Here's my card. Painting credit card. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for his check now. So, uh, He's gonna sign with a gracious tip. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> I would have went full rock opera. I just want to let you know. <laughs> we can get there. We can get there. Uh, so I, I go uh, in towards Austin, closer to downtown, uh, where I find uh, the Home Depot rental departments to be a little more coarse, a little more you should know this. Oh, yeah. So I call and I say, hello, do you have a trencher? And they're like, yeah, of course. And yeah. uh, I was like, I would like to rent one. In fact, I, I would, and, and tell me if I'm, if, tell me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Home Depot. Uh, hi, uh, is this the tool rental department? Yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, I need, I need to dig a trench. What would be the best thing for me to do that? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, the guys, the guys said I should get a trencher. Okay. Do, do you guys have a trencher? This is shockingly close to how it went. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys have a trencher available right now, or are they all rented up? <laughs> yes. Oh, right. Uh, so, so how do I get that? Uh, do, uh, uh, do I need a trailer, or I, I got a pickup? I can put it in a pickup. Yes. Right. So I. God damn, this is fucking on the nose. <laughs> uh, uh, so okay. So if I show up with a pickup truck. Uh, how do we get the trencher? Do you, do you have like ramps I can use or? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so I'll use a ramp. <laughs> I'm gonna collect the trencher. Yeah. You, this is like some ESP shit. <laughs> uh, and then, uh, uh, okay, well, I'll, I'll be there shortly. And and I show up and I, I pull up the car. I was like, I would like a trencher. And then they give me a trencher. Do you know what a trencher is? Me? Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, Annalisa's laughing at both of us. Yeah. Uh, oh no, no. I'm I'm a a foppish dilettante. <laughs> like I, <laughs> I've 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 come from the city. These hands have done nothing but type. Picture and then eventually they stopped typing when I realized that my mouth could make enough money. <laughs> uh, uh, picture a lawnmower. 
that's a chainsaw. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Right? Okay. Oh. So a uh, uh, guy comes out, and he just drops a couple of uh, planks and uh, says, okay, and then leaves. There you go. So I look, and I, I twist knobs, and I pull the thing, and it goes, and I take the planks. It, it, I, if you have not been to Home Depot, there is another section that is tool is, is, is what – Brian is calling, which is just for contractors, specifically so, professional contractors, yes, just for contractors. <laughs> and so, like, so, so all well, yes. Annalise is giving like a try hard, like, like, <laughs> mm, but, but, but in general, especially in places where you do a, like, there's a lot of landscaping and stuff like that. So it was very, very big in Florida. You would have people. So like that guy who's picking up. The reason why he's treating Brian like a fucking idiot is because is normally they're like, they're like, hey, do you have a Four and three quarters, blah, 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 blah. And then he actually has to look in a book or something like that. And then he gives you the same yes or no. <laughs> it's like, it's it's the equivalent of somebody calling us here in the middle of the show and saying, hello, uh, do you have cameras? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Basically. Yes. <laughs> uh, so uh, uh, the the thing is, I uh, like like a self-driving uh, lawnmower, I have, to, I have to pull the thing and it has to drive up the ramp. And I, I don't know if it's going to... So I, I get it up the ramp, I get it in the back of the car, and I put it up, and I take the ramp things that I guess I'm renting, and I put them in the back of the truck, and then I drive on back, and I, and I, and I, uh, I wake up Jeff at uh, 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 one in the afternoon, and then I, and then I say, <laughs> oh my hey, God. we're going we're gonna to trench. Uh, we're going <laughs> to trench. And he's like, cool. And so I, so I come on out, and I, I lower the thing. Uh, lowering was more scary because... Um, uh, it just seems like it's going to fall out. Anyway, uh, uh, so I'm like, and we're trenching. And the, the, the saw comes down. And yep. it goes, ah, bada, 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 and, uh, and it sits there. And then I hit And in that moment, you're feeling like, I am a man. I'm also concerned that it doesn't seem like anything's happening. Yeah. <laughs> <And then> Another <laughs> relatable feeling for being a man. <laughs> <laughs> and then <it> finally... <laughs> And finally, I pull. Shouldn't, shouldn't, shouldn't she? I mean, it be doing something by now. So it just sits here. I guess I'll just keep it going. <laughs> it's a. This isn't like it was in the video. <laughs> and so I pull on the handle that goes in reverse, and it starts dragging, 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 dragging. And I look, and I'm like, there, there's the beginning of my trench. And I think to myself. Shouldn't it be more than one inch? <laughs> Again. Okay. <laughs> All right. Enough, 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 enough. <laughs> so I spend three hours back and forth, up and down. All right, come on. Wow, come on. Man. Come on. Try hard. <laughs> At the end of three hours, I say to Jeff, I have to return the trencher. Uh, I am aware that we now have a well-polished Groove of bedrock. <laughs> uh, that Yabba is, dabba do. That is one inch deep, and uh, it's just pure limestone. So I I drive that. We we clean the trencher and drive it, return it, and whatever. Yep. Oh, that's a hard day is nothing. Yep. And uh, next day, wake up. Not before oh, we yeah, lost a yeah. shovel, Jeff. Uh, actually, uh, Jeff, I think we have a shovel and a pickaxe somewhere. One hour later, Jeff, we don't. Uh, Go buy one. <laughs> and then, and then and we try pickaxing on the limestone. Oh. You're just like working. It sounds on... dumb when I say it out loud. Yeah. Work... <laughs> really, really working on the railroad, huh? <laughs> that is the stupidest thing in the universe. Come here. Come here. Right, come, Jeff, here. Jeff, come, Jeff, here. come here. Jeff. Come here. Come here. You're going to be on. Yeah. Right, Jeff McLaughlin, go. everybody. Winner in chief, Jeff McLaughlin. All right. You were saying it was so smart? This entire project <laughs> has been the dumbest thing on earth. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and? So wait, hold on. When, when Brian tells you to go buy a pickaxe, because there's <laughs> a solid <laughs> sheet of limestone. Yes. Uh, uh, what's your first thought? Uh, my, well, I mean, to be fair, my first thought was there is no way on earth that this is going to fucking work. But I had a little bit of optimism. A little yeah. bit. A little bit. And I'm like... We took care of that, didn't I we? Can... <laughs> <laughs> and so, and so my, 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 my tiny bit of optimism was shattered 
when I actually tried to pickaxe. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. The, the limestone. Fucking, the fucking... The like, unbroken sheet of limestone. Yes. It didn't just shatter like a fucking chocolate egg. Also, I, I, I should have seen this coming because at some point there was like... A, a, one, of, one of the rooms in HQ is kind of sunk a little bit, so I had some a foundation person come out, and they said, well, uh, uh, no. And I was like, what do you mean no? And they were like, your whole house is on bedrock it's what however far it's sunk is as far as it could possibly go yeah. everything is bedrock so i should have eh, yeah, that information that one did away. not translate into what we were doing over with the new building that's so, right there. We, didn't, we didn't think about that no 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 all right so so uh, a feudal because attack we're done. With, with, with with the with, with the pickaxe next morning prime brush He's gonna get it done. Oh my Once God. in well, the road. I know what the, I know what the problem was. The problem was I went too far into those city folk lands. Yeah. I shouldn't have headed towards downtown. I should go out to the country. I should go to the small rural town of Dripping Springs. Ring ring. But first he goes. Ring, Back ring. to torches. <laughs> the problem was that he only had one beer at lunch. <laughs> Time to order two beers. <laughs> well, tell him about the uh, uh, jackhammer, though. Oh, well, uh, 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 if you insist. <laughs> <laughs> I do, because that was also fucked up. <laughs> so things escalate. Well, so I go... <laughs> I go and, and I did watch like a video on trenchers and I followed all the instructions, all that stuff. But then, but then I got to uh, way out, way out west, and uh, I, I got a jackhammer. And then the last thing uh, the girl says to me before I rent the jackhammer, she goes, "You do know how to use one of these, right?" <laughs> and I said, "Ah, uh, <laughs> I mean, humor me." <laughs> <laughs> and she was like, "So you go with a fucking uh, 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 a dashing debonair George Clooney one-liner instead of just like a very utilitarian yes, ma'am." <laughs> it was it was sufficiently self-deprecating, and I, like I would appreciate. No, no, just, that's a just bad remind thing me to of do the... at Home Depot. Do not self-deprecating is not what you want. She did not seem phased because she, she was... doesn't give a fuck. You already signed the waiver. <laughs> <laughs> she she says, you plug it in, you pull this thing, and it goes ka jugga jugga. Right. <laughs> like, and that's cool. pretty much how it went. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So got a jackhammer. Uh 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 Jeff uh, asleep. Uh uh Dr. <laughs> Crowen. Gary's As over usual. there making his yep. uh, uh 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 first thing I discover is that the Jeep is not as big as the truck, so I have to take everything apart and put it in the back seats of the Jeep. Uh Jackhammers, very heavy. Uh, get in first thing in the morning, uh, plug in the thing, extension cord, plug in the other thing, set up the jackhammer, attach the bit to the jackhammer. Okay, here we go. Pull the thing. Oh, look at that. Yeah, oh, going it. straight yeah, down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's pull this thing out. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Nope. Oh. Nope. Just, just the. Just a just it's stuck. A, it's just a cross yeah. embedded in limestone. Yeah. Oh. Uh, there's no No give. No. 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 An hour later. <laughs> I'm, 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 but da, 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 but da, 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 but da, and then I'm, I'm making very small progress uh, in the limestone. Bonnie shows up. It's now noon o'clock. Uh, I have to return the jackhammer in 30 minutes because it's a four hour rental, because how hard a job gonna be am i right oh my fucking god you only rented it for four hours Dude, I mean, there's so all, much fucking rock it's down all there. it's only there's it's only so feet, right? get it's the it. fuck out of here <laughs> you just returned the trencher after three hours and one inch <laughs> so your your defiance toward <laughs> god is, <laughs> is shocking <laughs> bonnie this, this is this is a man versus nature story yep yeah, and you're losing, and we failed. <laughs> we we completely failed. It oh. is now the sun is out. It's 92 degrees. It's just past noon. I'm about to call to extend the rental, and Bonnie shows up. And you ever have that moment when you're talking to someone and they're looking at you, but really they're looking through you yeah. and judging you. And uh, I was like, yeah, no, just uh, whew, just real heavy and just working on the thing and stuff. So I I, I get, Bonnie leaves. And I get back to work, and I finally decide it's too hot. I need a break. I need to hydrate. So I come back, and I begin researching alternatives to 18 inches to meet code. Uh, uh, at which point, uh, around 1 o'clock, Jeff comes in, opens the door like, Oh, whoa, 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 man. 
uh, and I was like, hey, what's up? I'm just jackhammering out there. He's like, yeah, well, I just, I, I, I rebooted my phone and I saw your text message. And then I saw, I, I saw other text messages. Uh, it, it, what's going on? <laughs> Wait, what? That, that was a clue to a certain <laughs> correspondence that both, I both both of you guys have very funny. red faces what right is, now. Yeah. Well, okay. well, we're well, very embarrassed so, about so, our behavior. So that the, day. the 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 true story is that by, while my phone was shit before I got my uh, one that Brian just gave me, but um, <laughs> uh, and, and and so I, I normally have to like reboot right. my phone. Long in the story short, I pieced Long together short, instantly that the other messages was Bonnie, Bonnie saying, saying, "Please go make fucking sure Brian check doesn't Brian die <laughs> right <laughs> now. <laughs> like you need to fucking go check on him." Wow. And I was just like, "Okay, dude, I'll go fucking help him." It's now like, it becomes a two-person job. It, it, gotcha. So, Comedy ensues. Yeah. Oh. We only made it 14 inches. I can't believe that you... St I still can't believe that you fucking put that together. Yeah. Like the... It's, the, it's, the, it's the, called ADD, Yeah, I got my your friend. message in a few <laughs> other messages, and you're like, fucking Bonnie. Uh, like, so anyway, like, uh, here's the new plan. That's the trench. Uh, we're just going to lay down a cable, and I'm going to buy, like, uh, 20 cubic yards of fill, and just, congrats, it's 18 inches. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, jump up Bam, 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 this is her problem, not mine. Do you need a situation? No, this, I'll tell you the situation. The situation is uh, uh, when we're going to sleep at night, I tend to go to sleep before her, and she notices this because I start snoring while she's trying to go to sleep, which makes it harder for her to go to sleep. Mm. And so I have uh, uh, come up with a character to exacerbate an already annoying situation. <laughs> Do you get the elbow? I get the elbow. Oh, well, I don't know it. I, I, I'm, you're just suddenly I, I, awake. I am a, no, no, no. I'm a very sound sleeper. Oh, so she can actually so just jelly. Like, kick me and I don't give a fuck. Uh, so the character is um, Sleppy Giuseppe. Sorry? Sleppy Giuseppe. Sleppy. Yeah. Sleppy. Mm -hmm. It's like sleepy, but I'm uh, altering the word to make it rhyme better. <laughs> right. Did, 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 yeah. he, did he play in the American League? Uh, uh, no, no, it's very simple, and there's kind of a bit here, so, okay. uh, um, uh, it's a me, <laughs> sleepy, just happy, oh boy, I'm ready, I'm ready to go do anything, I'm ready to go a race in the Formula One, <laughs> I'm gonna race in the Formula One, Bryce, you love the Formula One, yeah, don't you? I do. Oh, the Ferrari races in the Formula One, oh, I'm gonna get behind the wheel, oh. I'm gonna get behind the wheel, I'm gonna race in the Formula One, <laughs> here we go, here we go. <laughs> So, is is your goal every time you're awakened to to? Oh, I, I guess you you don't wake up when when whenever you get elbow. No, yeah. Mostly, I'm just annoying my wife. <laughs> this is when I'm awake before I go to sleep. See, and I, I just annoy my wife with Sleppy Giuseppe. I w I would think there would be like game theory because I don't enjoy. You know how difficult it is for me to fall asleep, and yes. when I do fall asleep, I do sometimes snore. Because you are a light sleeper. Sleep. Yes, correct. Yes. Uh, uh, but but but. <laughs> This is a brilliant strategy. Yeah. And every time I am shocked out of sleep, I go into annoying character. So then she has to do the yes. calculus of Do I well, want to hear Sleppy Giuseppe? <laughs> or do I want to do I want to help yeah. with, with What's the snoring? Better, this very light, gentle, rhythmic <laughs> snoring. Or it's a me. <laughs> a sleepy Giuseppe. Oh, I'm a gonna do it. The Nathan's hot dog eating a contest. <laughs> oh boy, I'm a beat the Joey Chestnut. I'm a gonna go. Oh, give me all of these hot dogs. I'm a gonna eat them all. I'm a gonna go. I'm a gonna eat the hot dog. <laughs> so.
so 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 <laughs> it, it's kind of it's kind of the same game because because you're thankful when it finally the the white noise shows up. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. Anyway, Sleppy Giuseppe. I stand a, I'm a terrible I stand a Sleppy Giuseppe. Yep, yeah, me too. Me I'm, too. I'm, a, I'm a bad husband. Anyway, Bryce, yep. next topic. Our next love love it. It. <laughs> Brian's butt message. Oh, it's finally happened. It's on your phone. You sent a phone message. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, that was very yeah. funny. <laughs> it made it made you laugh a lot. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna read you a text exchange. Uh, first of all. Can I, can, I, can I set it up? Let, yeah. let, let, let me set it up and you just read what, what, what the message was. Okay. So, uh, Brian is working with our partners at Doghouse Systems. Uh, uh, a, a fine, I have, I have a, 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 a computer from Doghouse Systems that I bought with my own money. And uh, Brian has a bunch of stuff here. They have really outfitted this entire place. So, big, uh, uh, gigantic applauses for Doghouse Systems. Huzzah! Uh, but even further in their good guy status, they're hooking up uh, uh, on Elisa here on, on a new PC. Ooh. And so Brian is going back and forth on exactly how they're going to make the most awesome PC possible for Annalisa. And uh, uh, they're going back and forth. They're like, oh, we're going to use this part. We're going to use that part. Everything's going to be put together. This is going to be super, super awesome. And then at the moment of, of everything coming together, Brian texts the following. Well, <clears throat> <laughs> yeah. So I uh <laughs> damn it. So <laughs> it, lots of back and forths, lots yep. of discounts. Yep. yep. Uh okay, we got an 11th Gen I core uh Gen Core i9 11900K yep. with the same chassis that was spec'd yep. out 64 gigs of memory, 1 terabyte Samsung 980 Pro. That's twice as fast as what would normally work with the Armor SS RTX 3080. 3 year warranty. The chassis is brand new. There was a hiccup when we did the laser etching. The top of the D isn't there. My response. Oh, yes, this has sunk. It has sunk as far as we'll ever be to possibly think it's done. I don't know what's wrong with me, but I like Wabi Sabi Sabi. <laughs> Next text. Right, so that's going to be uh, <laughs> this amount plus shipping. If you could let her know, yep. give me that email. Uh, yeah, in my pocket. Uh, we I, don't need an explanation. Uh, okay, Bryce, next right. up in. The inside scoop from ICS. <laughs> yeah, so uh, I called, a, uh, uh, not not only are we professional friendlies with our friends over in Ice, uh, Ice Cream Social, but uh, occasionally I'll call up Matt and have a real heart to heart. And so I called him with yeah. all of my emotional filters totally disabled. And he answered with the one thing I, I was not prepared to hear, which is, Brian Brushwood, you're live on Ice Cream Social. At which point, shields up. <laughs> and all I did was, I, I, I don't, do we have it? Uh, we, we don't. It's, okay, it's all right. In, yeah. uh, 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 do, 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 we, do we have the the, 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 the t-shirt? Can somebody, uh, no, we don't have the t-shirt. Was that just oh, on okay. your phone? Oh, yeah. Then, yeah. Then, 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 then you just look it up on your phone, because I, I do want to get a live <laughs> rendition of exactly what was said. Yeah. So uh, basically, I just burst out. Uh, I was like, uh, uh, "Yeah, I thought we were gonna have a conversation, but I'm not prepared." Fuck, uh, fuck you in the face. Fuck all your faces. Fuck your butt faces. <laughs> fuck your genital faces. Uh, fuck your titty faces. Fuck all the faces. <laughs> you leaky, leaky nipple fuckers. Fuck you. <laughs> boop, boop, boop. And then I beeped out. And apparently, uh, that was that was so iconic <laughs> that uh, 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 Brogan yes uh, uh, made a T-shirt out of it. Yes, here, I'll send it over to Bryce, <laughs> and we'll see if we can get it uh, maybe at the, or, or do we have another one, or? No, oh, that's, uh, that was going to be our big finale. Okay, there we finale. go. Uh, we'll get to it after we thank the people who keep us alive. Indeed. 20% of our audience has vanished. Yes. That's it, a real thing. It is. It's not just in the MCU. No. Nope. This is real. Yep. Can you explain? Climate change. Uh, yes, the climate mm -hmm. around Patreon's tolerance for anybody pledging less than $1 per episode yep. has certainly changed. It has. And that's why suddenly 20% of yep. our patrons are gone. CFCs. It's kind of a big deal. Yep. Not a joke like the ozone. Nope. <laughs> this is for real. This yep. affects us. See, that would have been good for Alt-Right Sports Center. Okay. <laughs> 
That's true. Uh, <laughs> so if you are unsure if you're pledging or not, head on over to patreon.com slash great night. Look, I want to apologize. Thank for every patron that has uh, been suffering through content that the bonus episodes have not had me on it. I know that there's been an outcry. The feedback we're getting is pretty good. There's been an outcry. There's been an outcry. They're like, I think we're we're getting notes that it's actually better than it's ever been before. Yeah, yeah. yeah, uh, You're welcome. I hear hear the sounds. I hear the cry from the populace. They say we're deficient in vitamin J. Well, specifically. I'm here to say that it will be back (laughs) this Thursday. In fact, we're going to lighten the load a little bit. Maybe a little less Bryce, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess that's one way to. I mean, if we're talking about it being the best ever, oh, all of a sudden, I'm maybe just going somebody by what else is said. a little vengeful on this step. Oh, if that wow. made you angry, there's only one way to show your rage, and that's to donate one dollar per episode at two dollars. Patreon, two dollars, two dollars per episode. Come on, no, that's at the whole Patreon.com <laughs> slash great night. No, for real, uh, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Obviously, this has uh, uh, been a an, an insane travel time, and thank you to Brian and Bryce for for uh, picking up the slack. But we will continue, especially, you know, you know, we love our holiday episodes. Uh, yeah. we, have, we have always done big stuff for for all of our our holiday episodes, and we are coming into that season. So please join, and we will uh, we will have a good time together. Uh, Patreon.com. <laughs> Bryce, did, did we get that picture? Uh, yeah, uh, uh, yeah. I was gonna. Yes, here it is. <laughs> <laughs> here we go. Uh, Fuck but... you in the face. Wait, hold on. Can I read it? Fuck yeah. you in the face. Fuck all your faces. Fuck your butt faces. <laughs> Fuck your genital faces. Fuck your <laughs> titty faces. Fuck all your faces, you leaky nippled fuckers. It's gonna be a thing. Fuck you, Brian Brushwood. And and the way that Brogan draws you is is extraordinarily flattering. You look amazing. <laughs> you look amazing. I, I, I do get hotter when I give double middles. Yeah. No. That's a good look. <sighs> Bryce, you got a game for us? Are you going to buy that shirt? Is that uh, shirt well, available? first of all, it's not a shirt. What's funny, well, what's funny is I said I need this as a shirt, and somebody piped up saying, it is available as a shirt. And it's and, 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 and Brogan it? was like, what the actual fuck? That's my oh, art. Oh, shit. Oh, oh <laughs> yeah. somebody just put it on a thing? Yeah. Brogan, make a goddamn store. There we go. That was literally just <laughs> me yelling at one person. Uh, uh, Bryce, do we have a game? Uh, we do. Uh, we've uh, done this before. It's been a little while, but we're going to dive into the world of AliExpress. Woo! Ali Babers. <laughs> so we've gone and uh, I-, I found some products over on Alibaba.com. This is mm-hmm. the uh, drop shipping website from where you can get all sorts of cheap crap from China. <laughs> just a bunch of just a bunch of crap. Jesus, Trump. Okay. Okay. <laughs> all right. So I'm going to show you something. Everyone's going to many take a- such cases. <laughs> Everyone's going to take a guess at what you think the item that I show you is, uh, and whoever's closest as determined by science will get a point. Brett, uh, Brett, would you like to play? I would love to play. Okay. Very good. Everybody know how this goes. I'm going to yep. show you something. You're going to say something. Okay. <laughs> it's it's that easy. We're going to do some AliExpress. Jackhammer. All right, gentlemen, we are starting with this item, uh, this item up front here. Uh, Justin, can you describe what we're looking what at? For the love visually. Of Christ, is it? It looks like a backpack that has a wand on it that's connected via a tube. I'm Wait, do I do I guess what it is or just Yeah, you're you're going to uh, and you'll start. You're going to guess what you believe that this object is. I think that this is a gigantic water gun. You say it's I, a very big water gun. I, I think yeah, you fill all the water in the backpack and then the wand is a huge pump that you would spray water. Now, I don't know how much water you would really get out of it. It feels like it'd only be like 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 15 pumps out of that gigantic wand, but uh, 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 yeah, that's what I think it is. All right. Uh, Brian, what do you think this object is? To me, the most curious aspect is the fact that it's clearly made like an old man's cane. I'm not sure why that is, but it makes me all the more certain that it is the exact opposite of what Justin suggested. And instead, this is to suck water out of a pond and put it in your backpack so you can die later. 
Okay. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Did you say die later? Yeah, because you're going to drink the shit water. Yeah. But you don't want to do it there. And you certainly don't want to do it unless you're dilated. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, all right. I'm a bond. <laughs> A shitty pond, but you know you don't want to die on the rocks. Take it back to your apartment. Die in dignity, sip in that filth water. Pond scum. <laughs> nope. That's all I got. Brett? Uh, I Respectfully, uh, I think both <laughs> of you have very good points. You make very good points. Uh, uh, I am going to have to say that it's uh, even different than that. I think it's a, definitely a backpack, but it's a high pressure colonic. That's what I think it is <laughs> on a backpack for yourself or others. I, you know, <laughs> I mean, that looks that's like another. Not for me to judge. Well, cause that's I would not... say if it was for yourself, the, the tip would have to hook. I, uh... What? <laughs> True. Well, but it looks like there is. I mean, it is one. It would be. Long. It would be like a like a back scratcher, but for your butthole. For your butthole. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good point. Yeah. I stick by my statement. And I I appreciate your resolve. Sure. I I affirm both of you. What are we doing? I was putting a fire out. Did you just say it was a colonic? What? Did yes. You yeah. I'm saying that it's a portable backpack colonic. Yeah. Okay. A portable colonic. All right. Or for <laughs> yourself or other animals. Yeah. <laughs> Other animal? Who's what animal am I? You know what animal are we? I a filthy really animal. animal. I don't want you, 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 you <laughs> wild minx. <laughs> All right, we got your answers here. Justin said a water gun. Brian said a water vacuum. Brett said a <laughs> another version a of a water gun. A portable colonic. <laughs> yeah. Uh, all right. Well, uh, gentlemen, we're gonna take a look at what this thing is. This is no, don't no, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> right under that. Put it on the bingo card. <laughs> Gentlemen, this is the manual fertilizer applicator, fertilizer applicator, spreader, fertilizer applicator, granular. <laughs> okay. That's a water gun. That's a water gun, baby. Yeah. Well, That's a water gun. Uh, but what do you put in there? Fertilizer applicator, Wait, fertilizer, fertilizer applicator, fertilizer <laughs> applicator, <laughs> ding dog. made of what? Well, see, that's the thing, Brett, is I think I'm going to give you the point on that one because... It's got poo. You put poo poo in. Yeah, there, there, yeah. there's. What the fuck? There, yeah, it's legit, man. There, there's no, more fertilizer. A colonic in your butt. is an irrigator for poo poo. Uh, it is not a collector or spreader of poo poo. It's still poo poo. <laughs> I mean, a what water gun. What the fuck? Yeah, still okay, animal okay, poo poo. Okay, so yeah. if, if you're gonna grow corn. Right, you wanna know what? You wanna play this fucked up game? Yeah. Play this fucked up game. <laughs> oh, Go. Shit. Give him the fucking point. Let's see. I will. Let's shit. see. All right. You want a comedy show? Let's get a comedy show. All right, fuck it. That's a point to Brett. Congrats, Brett. <laughs> yeah. Hey, congrats, mm. Brett. Hey, I I appreciate your appreciation of me. Fuck. I thought we were all affirming. This was such good vibes. And then the fucking refs <laughs> come in. What's next, and Bryce? <laughs> <laughs> all right, our next round. We're doing Bruce impressions. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fertilizer with my backpack. You don't just have one that's some back. shit water on, there. All right, guys, we're going to give you this up. one here. We're going to start with Brian on this. What are we looking at, first off? Uh, well, it's a it's a traditional house key from the Middle Ages with a gnome, uh, kind of a low-budget Santa action happening. Looks like, uh, it, 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 it looks like a haunted key. <laughs> It, I was gonna say, feel like you got all of it. <laughs> <laughs> there's snowflakes. Yeah. There's holly, mistletoe. Okay. Good cheer. Great. It's. Uh, what do you think it is? It's a self-defense weapon. You're gonna say it's a self-defense <laughs> weapon. Yep. What? Uh, if, uh, sometimes Santas be creeping on you in the night. Key to his heart is to kill him with a knife. Jesus said that. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was the last thing he said. <laughs> he said that up on the cross. Yep. So he's posting. Yeah. Santa. Like, oh oh he's shit, 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 shit. One more thing. <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck. One more thing. One more thing. I swear to God. I, I was I told myself I was gonna remember to say this, and then it was just what Brian said. <laughs> <laughs> Someday they're gonna want to celebrate my birthday, yeah. but they're gonna make yep. up a, a fucking dude who thing. sells Coca-Cola. Yeah, so <laughs> the only way to kill him is it with this key. Yeah, I can't even, I could describe it, but if somebody, everybody got a pencil? Anyone got a pencil? <laughs> and then he died. 
R.I.P. Diamond J. Absolutely right. (laughs) Brett, what say you? I uh, also believe that it is a Christmas key, uh, but it's for a lock for the uh, Christmas Container well, like, to secure all the presents. The classic Christmas <laughs> container that we all gather Christmas around every day. Oh, I remember we would mm-hmm. sing yep. carols around the old mm-hmm. lockbox. Christmas <laughs> container. <laughs> yep. And sometimes mm-hmm. we would try to shake it to figure out what's inside. Yep. Oh, hey, Christmas go, yep, box. Oh, Christmas box. Oh, how you contain our gift. <laughs> yep. Oh, Christmas box. Oh, Christmas box. Only one specific key can open you <laughs> you remain closed all of the time <laughs> it never opens oh no what a christmas tragedy we need santa to save the day <laughs> it's funny. like midway through that i heard my own voice singing so off key that i'm like you're not gonna get better than this <laughs> All right, so Brett, uh, what, uh, what, what, did, what did you say? You said it was a I said a key to open the Christmas box. Oh, right. <laughs> Christmas key to open the Christmas lock for yeah. the Christmas okay. container. Justin, what about you? Bottle opener. <laughs> You're going to say a bottle opener? Yeah, no, I'm going to boycott jokes. <laughs> Oh, actually, that does look like a bottle opener. I'm going to boycott jokes because now I want to win. <laughs> it's a bottle opener, Bryce. It All right. Hey, Bryce. <laughs> yeah. It opens bottles. Gotcha. It's got the bottom part of it. You know how bottles are closed? <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. And you got to, like, 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 if this was, yeah, like, yeah, if this yeah. was I mean, closed, maybe if you can yeah. give us an illustration. I got a bottle right here. Yeah. Yeah, hold on. Give there me it. Is. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. Dude. He needs a, right, he's going to need a bottle what opener. What you need is one of those. There we go. See, yeah. yeah it's, uh, it's, uh, sorry. Comedy again, co-host. again, again, fucking uh, very soft tits. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we've got your answers here. Brian said it was a self-defense weapon. Yep. Brett said it was the key to unlock the Christmas box yep. container. Yep. And Justin said it was a bottle opener. Cut my hand. It, no. <laughs> it's really good. Your no, hand it's fine. Hurt. Oh, my God. Get some aloe. It's fine. I, I cut my hand. You can't afford to have an injury counter on this show, too. I'm just saying. <laughs> All right. <laughs> we very are... soft hands. New York City hands. <laughs> All right. We are looking at this object is... Fast shipping antique copper metal Santa key Christmas ornaments, Santa's magic keys, and I will direct your attention to the branding here. Brett, can you please read the words on the screen? Dear Santa, we have no chimney. Please use this special key. Oh my God, the box is the house. He was right the whole time. (laughs) Santa's real. Have I told you about my side job? Wait, what is that? Yeah, what is it? Is it is it? He's running for Congress in New York. (laughs) My name is Itkus. Yes, I'm busting on the harbor for all. That's a Brett boy. Yay! He got it exactly right. Bottle opener, though. I mean, it was very clearly a bottle. Very clearly a fucking bottle. bottle No, you give it to kids when you live in a place that doesn't have a chimney. Shut the fuck up. (laughs) (laughs) Jesus Christ! All right. No Santa Claus, Brian. I hear you. (laughs) God damn it! I feel this is this is my own sublimated humiliation leaking out. I apologize. Justin, I'm in a I'm in a bad place, man. I Justin, lost two I ones love, in a row, and I love, now I feel I love bad. You, Justin, I need you to stop it. <laughs> I don't like you mocking me. I don't like you fucking mocking me with this Christ. fucking bullshit. Quick, I love ask, you, ask another Brian. Get out of here! All right, here's our next one. Uh, Fuck you, Brett. Uh, <laughs> Brett, can you uh, tell us the device that we're looking at on the screen, please? Oh boy, look at that. Yeah, wow. Uh, man, it's I almost can't see it. Uh, uh, it looks to be maybe some sort of uh, feminine mask. <laughs> uh, it's my favorite mask. Prince song. Yes. <laughs> it's a feminine, feminine mask. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, 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 yeah. It's, it looks like a vinyl or rubber mask. All right. Uh, that goes over your eyes. Yes. But it's only for women. Yes. All right. Only for ladies. Yep. Justin, what about you? What do you think this product is? I believe that it is a 
a, a belly massager. <laughs> and I think it is for menstrual cramps. Wow. A menstrual cramp massager. Okay. From China. From, from, okay, I'll write that down. Where Apple. menstrual cramps were born. <laughs> I don't know that that... I don't know that that Look tracks. it up. I don't know. Marco Polo. It's in the <laughs> silk drawing road. market. Brian, what about you? What do you think this product is? This is clearly a... Okay, th- there are icons. One is there are icons. two bees back to back. The other is a campfire. Then there's an... A googly eye looking off to the side. Mm-hmm. Outside of that, it looks like an... Wait a minute. I see stitching. Looks like fabric. This is a... A... Uh, the, uh, a... Bo- <laughs> um, <laughs> the, God, it, it, goes, it goes on your wrist. Uh, it goes on your wrist and, and, and it, 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 it measures Carper your shame. Carper tunnel? Oh. <laughs> Shame man. Right. No, I, I I said it. I have to stick with it. It measures a shame, shame. measure. Yeah, yeah. It's shame. It so if measures, you had, if it you measures had, your shame. If you had one on your wrist right had, now, what would it say? It would say. It would be maybe beeping. Spend. Yep. Justin's turn thinking of an answer. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of <laughs> very judgmental device. <laughs> Vengeful. Vengeful. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now let's. Be... All right. We've got your answers here. You guys have said. Brian said it was a shamo meter. Shamo meter, excuse me. A shamometer. It also detects frogs. Shamometer. shamometer. <laughs> Thank you, Alex. It's <laughs> is a sham. Brett has said it's a feminine mask. Yes. And Justin mm-hmm. has said it's a belly massa- massager for menstrual pain from China. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Would you say it like Thank that? Thank you for leaving off gender. That sounds Thank you like for leaving that. off gender. Yeah. How 2022. It's exactly how it would be written. All right, guys. Let's take a look at what it is. Ooh. This is a portable electric super thin waist belt menstrual care oh! period pain relief rechargeable Justin is right because he gets menstrual cramps. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. That's exactly right. That's a point for Justin. Can we, uh, I'd like to you show you. You know what's funny you. is I was going to make a case for it still being shameful, but you were so proud of that. Yeah. I can't even. Yeah, congrats. Oh, he got his tongue out. Ugh. Uh, let's yeah, go. fucking yeah! Take that one away from me. I've been fucking. I would all goddamn if you night. put on this belt. Hey, Justin. <laughs> yeah, I, I still love you. You want to know what? What? Now I accept it. Oh, come on! <laughs> all right, because I'm on top. It doesn't okay. matter if it's inauthentic. Conditional I love. Will still sure. take it. The best a type gracious, of love. A sure. gracious host. Good. I will accept it. Yep. Uh, some of the features: it's ergonomic design, perfectly for both women and male, elder <laughs> or young people. Uh, it's got three temperature levels. 45 degree is just keep warm. Sure. 55 degree is good for tire relief. 65 <laughs> degree is good for pain relief, of course. It also comes with three vibrating modes, and there is an extra pouch inside, so you can put herbs in it when you Yeah, you, you can. Yes, you can. Yeah, you can. Hey, brother. Yeah. Hey, pack the, those what herbs. A, what about my pizza rolls? Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if the pouch is compatible with pizza rolls. Yeah. Yeah. No. All right, that's interesting. Anna, uh, Annalise is running to Ali Babers and fucking putting in <laughs> putting in a bid. Is uh, uh not very expensive. It was what four fifty a yeah, unit. Five dollars. Well, what's the minimum buy? Uh, f- 50, 99. 50 of them. <laughs> yeah. Can we, can we get those branded? We we. Yes, you can. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, something for, <laughs> can, for can we have great stuff. night branded something menstrual for cramp stuff. relieving? Oh yeah, Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, after three rounds, the score: Brian has got zero points, Justin's got one, and Brett's got two big oh. points. Hey. We're going on to our next round. Everybody ready? Let's do it. All right, ready? Hey. Oh, we're living the dream, living. Bryce. All right, uh, uh, gentlemen, I'm going to have uh, this picture up here for you. What is this? <laughs> Uh, Is it mine? Uh, Justin, can you describe what we're looking at first, please? We are looking uh, at first, not the product, but uh, on the screen, a pig. A pig? Okay, great. Uh, uh, Shooting toward the pig is the Wi-Fi symbol (laughs) uh, emanating at the origin of that Wi-Fi symbol Looks to be a flashlight with an on button. <laughs> I uh, to to me it reads more like an arid extra dry roller applicator. 
It does. It looks looks a little bit, yeah, because it has With the power like, button. Yeah, it has it has like a, a, a bubble at the top yeah. with the power button, but I'm going to say that it is a pig startler. <laughs> a pig startler. If you see a pig and you're like, this fucking swine has had its fucking time in the sun for too long. Too long. I need to startle it. I got the exact gizmo for you. You whip this shit out, boom, hit a button. This pig is startled like a motherfucker. This is basically some shit that would be at the front of a rural sharper image. Uh, okay. You, you, when you said if you see a pig, I, like I, you were a dead ringer for Robert Stack in Unsolved Mysteries. <laughs> if you, if see, you a see a pig. <laughs> Call if you or someone you know has yes. seen a pig that needs to be startled. <laughs> Call me. Call ah. me. My number is nine five four. There you go, Brian. What do you think this object? Pig startler is pretty good. <laughs> I'm gonna say oh, it's a nice. sonic device. Even that, well, it does look like lights. Uh, oh, uh, I'm gonna say it's for uh, not pigs but feral hogs. It chases them away. They don't like Ow. it. With sound and light and fury, and it goes a little <laughs> something <laughs> like this. Mary the pig! He took out his pig! What the hell's a feral hog? That's a feral hog! Yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> oh, <God>. Wow. <laughs> and I'm startled over here. <laughs> <laughs> it just plays that. You, Another branded great night device. device? <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. We got your Christmas covered. Pigs, teenagers, you name it. <laughs> All right. Brett, you're the <laughs> You know, Bryce. <laughs> yes, sir. If I was making a Pigs, joke, teenagers? I would say this was a pig starter. <laughs> Not a twisted pig starter. A twisted pig starter. <laughs> not. Okay. Oh, it's not. Okay. It's not that. All right. What do we got? I think it's really obvious what this thing is. So obvious. It is a pig identifier. That is what it is. A pig. Is, I, yep. That's a pig. All right. <laughs> That's what that, so if you you're not it sure it's a pig or not. Yep. Oh, wait. Oh, I, I was thinking that it was a for real thing. Like, like you'd have all your pigs chipped and you would just know like, Meh. Sure. like that's, that's like, Terry. Like, one, one, one buzz. Yep. That's, that's Jamal. Dog. Yeah, yep. exactly. Yeah. I think that's why they put tags on them. I think yeah. they can tag them. Yep. I bet they chip them too. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. They chip them. Chip them. Alvin. Yep. That's your Simon. Yep. Theodore. <laughs> Theodore. That's yeah. Like all the best pigs. All right, we got your answers here. Uh, Justin has said a pig startler. <laughs> Brian said a. I believe it's pronounced startler. Start <laughs> startler. Startler. Yeah. Brian has. In fact, hold on, wait. Can you say it one more time? Sure. A pig startler. I want to eat Hannibal before you uh, can eat me. I'm doing my Sean Connery a little bit. It's a reference Brian. to a late stage Hannibal. There seems to be a big startler out. <laughs> That's the problem with these ladies. You gotta hit them with a pig startler now and again. A smack with their big startler. Brian has said a feral There's money penny. <laughs> you wanna see my big startler? Oh, oh, oh. Is that oh. fucked up? Yep. Okay. A bit. All right. Lesson learned. I love you. Yeah. Brian said a feral hog startler. <laughs> totally different idea. Completely different. Just entirely. <laughs> But he had, why, why am I he listening had the whole to you? Song. He had the whole song, though. <laughs> he had the whole song. That's, That's my a mistake, because I should be nothing thing. but calculating my next hit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Your next hit? <laughs> yeah, dude. I got to top the roll. He's on a roll. <laughs> and Brett has said a pig identifier. Yes. There we go. All right. Let's take a look at what this actually is. This is one of the hot sale wireless portable veterinary color B ultrasound scanner waterproof animal pig so sheep pregnancy ultrasound wow. tester. It's an ultrasound device. What's what's, what's more startling? <laughs> <laughs> uh, a little bit about the device. Traditional animal cable. The wireless, the handheld wireless pig pregnancy ultrasound scanner for pig sow is highly integrated with ultrasound image processing. 
power management, and wireless ultrasonic tester with a host to connect to the host via cable while the wire into... Okay, it's a long... Uh, yeah. yeah. So, uh, uh, did you we, see we that 100% absolutely fake ultrasound discovering a baby video? No. Uh, it, it appears to be a, a, a bunch of folks uh, uh, testing out ultrasound, learning how to use it. Like, oh, there's your... Like, quite literally, it, it, it adheres too perfectly to the rule of threes. Uh, 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 somebody administering this to uh, in a group says, uh, well, you can see there's your liver, there's your kidney, here's your pancreas. What's that? And then and somebody very clearly, and then, and, then, and then the answer is, turn the monitor towards all the other women who react visibly. And it's like, okay, all of that was set up. That was, that's, it's a good bit. It's a good bit. Totally fake. Totally fake. The baby's real. You're not fooled. I'm not fooled. <laughs> You're not fooled. Oh what Brian God, I, wants I, I, to know about this video is that he's not fooled. Mm -mm. So if you watch that video and you were fooled, but more importantly, you Wait thought that baby is, is born? Brian Brushwood fooled? Yeah. The answer, nope. unequivocally, nah, bro. <laughs> nah. Nah, bro. Nah. Not, am I the only one who's seen this? It I have no idea what yeah, the fuck you're talking about. That's probably for the best. I'm playing along with the bit. <laughs> right, you didn't speak in that exchange. Okay. Uh, what are you drinking? <laughs> Swing the camera over there. This oh, no, I, I need uh, everybody this, to see. I need everybody got, to see. I, I, I believe it, it's called Bay, Bayou. Is that what it's called? Uh, Bayou, uh, Bayou rum. It's, 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 it's Louisiana spiced rum. <laughs> but, he's, but, he's, but he's holding it up and like, it was just like a perfect moment of like Dean Martin confidence <laughs> that like he just looked, he looked at Brian and I and just goes like, I wasn't fooled. <laughs> <laughs> Blade along with a bit. Blade along. All right, there we go. That's Blade a point for Brett, by the way. Oh, oh shit! Oh. Yeah, you I identify the if the if the pig has got a baby in there or not. Yeah. All right. Yeah, mm -hmm. We're gonna go into another round. Does it baby. identify if the pig is impregnated with a feral hog? Never. Yeah. I, I regret. Probably. I open Probably. my yeah. mouth. Let's not judge. Bro. Let's not judge. Oh, you wake up in the morning. <laughs> I don't know. Get Jesus. your pig This is where pregnant. you want to go? You're pretty sure you're pregnant with your domestic pig. <laughs> and you have a big memory. <laughs> it was a fair long commit the other day. <laughs> 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 And you want to know. <laughs> That's why you need Brett Brand, Big Feral Hog, in utero identifier. <laughs> TM. Strangled. <laughs> from Tycho. <laughs> there you go. I'm Brett Weaver, and I approve this set. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to go to our penultimate round here. It's still anybody's game. It keeps Jesus. happening, Justin. Like, I keep opening my mouth, and I keep regretting it. <laughs> and to our benefit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to take it over to our next one here. Uh, this is Brian's turn. Brian, I'd love you to describe this device for me. What is it? Uh, well, uh, uh, what we have is a pistol-like device with what looks like a GoPro on top of it showing, you know, space, and six buttons on top, and a zoom-in of the buttons on top. And if I'm not mistaken, one of the buttons is a loop around and up, down, a left, right, a windshield wiper and a power, and... A feral hog. <laughs> I, was, I was about to say, I'll be damned. Uh, All it, right, fantastic. It, it, it looks like the... Uh, the, the 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 long protrusion is either chrome or uh, acrylic. I can't tell. Um, so let me just say, it's a a a, a planet repelling device. <laughs> a planet star. So if you got a planet too close to you, you're like, hey, Mister, hey, you need to better back back the fuck off. off. <laughs> well, yeah. uh, or Mrs. Yeah, the moon is a lady, Justin. Mm, space isn't as up to date as Earth is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Venus? Yeah, no. Oh, no. okay. No, hey. no. You, you hear the shit they say on Venus. Uh, <laughs> wait, oh, really? What do you Oh, yeah. Wait, wait. They're Fucked talking up shit. Really? Oh, yeah. What, what are they doing on Venus? Man, people on Venus are always running around saying, like, hey, get out of my way. 
<laughs> only only I can walk this way, <laughs> and then they walk like this. Well, I mean, that's not uh, that's I, anybody can walk like that. I, I mean, you try doing that in New York. <laughs> If you do that in New York, you're not going to get yeah. out of New York. Nope. Yeah, you don't think you're going to make it out of New Fucking York? Fucking like a Venusian? Oh, look at that. Fucking Snake Plissken over here is going to fucking escape from New York. <laughs> Bryce? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Brett, this is to you next. What do you believe this item is? I uh, I really like Brian's description. Uh, I like that there's a seems to be a camera on it so that you can see. <laughs> Uh, we get to I do think, this. We just get to say what we like about it I and describe it. Uh, well, you see, I'm I'm leading up to something, Brian. Mm-hmm. Uh, we it better be a song. It's gonna uh, come down Jesus. to <laughs> delivering. I think it I'll is a it pill delivery device. A what? Pill delivery. A pill delivery device. Okay. And that it it and then when you put the pill in right at the end of that thing. On the back there, and then you shoot it into whatever what, it is. Why, 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 why is there a GoPro that shows planets? It lets you know. It's just because right now it's it's like telescopic or microscopic, and it just says, you know, the the Chinese they don't always understand the this track. Jesus, <laughs> no, no, you know Jesus. what? It made sense at the end. He saved it. He said okay. the Chinese. The Chinese, <laughs> yeah, they don't know. Sometimes maybe they don't what it, because they're just doing marketing. It, this is just marketing, uh, and we need all to right. show that. Wait, I, I got, we got it. We got, we're just because you know what or? they do. No, no, we're good. We're good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Brett. Hey, Bryce. <laughs> yeah, hey. this is the guy you gave extra points. <laughs> I didn't give extra points. Just I gonna just, say, I gave him to say. Oh, reliable over here. <laughs> yep, not going on an extended rant about the Chinese. <laughs> It's not. It's your turn, so you still have some opportunities. Oh to... no, 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 yeah. Okay. I'll start bring, bring when, I'm, when, I'm, when I'm done shaming you. Bring it home, Justin. <laughs> I need a shameometer to let me know how much a shameometer. Oh my God, is that what it is? <laughs> You're like, holy shit, the shameometer is fucking going nuts. It's off the charts, Justin. We're looking for your answer. What is this device? I believe the device that we are seeing right now on our screens is a radar. You say it's a radar. What is it for? Like? Planets? Underwater activity. Mm, okay. I believe that it is for fish. <laughs> you can see where the fishies are. <laughs> hey, is there a fish under me? Let me take out my weird gun wand, point <laughs> it down into the water, <laughs> and it'll, it'll say, uh, uh, fish, yes or no. So, so two planets is fish, yes. <laughs> One planet. You don't know if that's a planet. That could be a pebble. <laughs> You're, uh, that could be that could be a jellyfish. Fuck you know, <laughs> uh, Bryce. Uh, yes. Okay. Well, we've got your answers here. Brian said a planet repellent. Yep. Brett said it was a pill delivery device, and Justin says it's <laughs> radar for underwater. Activity. I think all three of us pretty much nailed it. I think you're all yeah. pretty much there. Uh, this Some combination. This item is. Uh, folks, this is the cow's artificial insemination oh, device, cow oh, visual endoscope. Who said pill delivery device? Oh, God <laughs> damn it. <laughs> and that's going to be a Brett Weaver pull. <laughs> oh, look, I hate just as much as you did that he was oh, so no, right. No, 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 this one, this <laughs> one I got to give it to him. This one I got to give it to him. Uh, just, I got to give it to him. I throw this. I tried Yeah, it. Oh. sure you did. Oh. Sure you did. Well done. Well played. Mother they provide fucker. helpfully the four-step method of using the device. Which I'm Are not those not to... planets? It was planets. No, it's because it's got an HD display. Uh, <laughs> See? And if anybody wants yeah. to know if there are or are not cow vaginas on that page, there are cow vaginas on the product page. <laughs> <laughs> also, Brian, wait a minute. How do you know that being all up in a cow's guts doesn't look like the universe? <laughs> What do they know? I mean, I'm not saying nobody has yeah. experienced the universe. Exactly. I'm just saying I was unimpressed. One star. Bum, ba, da, <laughs> bum. Ba, na, na. Ah, ba, na, na. Na. All right. Ba, na, na, na. <laughs> All right, there we go. Okay, well, that's another point for Brett. Going in our final round, the scores are Justin has got one point. Uh-huh. Brian's got zero points. Ooh. And Brett's got four oh, big points. Oh, what? Of course, this is our five-point round. Five points. Five points. Five points. We're going to start with Brian on this one to give you the chance to catch up. Wait, but if I start... Okay. 
<laughs> it's not a guess. It's a, I can't catch up. They, I, I would have to pick whatever I pick. They'd have to both pick something. Okay. All this right. is a science game. It's not a numbers game. It's okay. It's a, yeah. Okay. Uh, what is this? Uh, what is this? It's device? a boat. <laughs> <laughs> Final answer. Boat. I'm going to say it's a boat. It does look like a little dinghy now, doesn't it? Actually, yeah. Boat. I'm going to say Take it's a boat. Why do you believe it's a boat? Because it's curved <laughs> and uh, shaped like a boat. And looks like a fucking boat. And it's got a, a scoop uh, at the bottom and a place for an engine. And it's made of plastic. It's got two little places to put uh, your fishing rods. It's, mm. it's, it's, it's a boat. Okay. Brian's going to say boat. Brett, what do you believe this object is? <sighs> well, I don't. I mean, there should be a little man in that boat. <laughs> so, but since there's not. Thank you. You're literally just looking. <laughs> But, audience of one, and she doesn't give a fuck. No, <laughs> you're literally trying to make one person laugh. Your wife is yep. right over your left shoulder, and she did not even like twitch. We're gonna have a conversation. Later. <laughs> but uh, what is the device, Brett? I think that <laughs> it is a uh, some type of uh, shipping container. That's what I. Think you mean a is. boat? <laughs> All right, that's going to say a shipping container. Shipping it's container. a way to transport people and or objects across Over. great distances of water. Uh, uh, uh. All right, Justin? there we go. Justin, this is up to you now. What is this object? You know. <laughs> oh, no. Wait for this one. <laughs> I think it's a boat. You know, there's just one thing I just can't figure out. Because it looks like a boat, but it also could be a boat-shaped ice cube for which you fill with water and then stays colder longer because it looks like a boat and you would put it in a drink if you were a fisherman. Hi, I'm Dumb Columbo. <laughs> I, we ain't gonna be that. Uh, okay. Bryce, how did how did dumb Columbo boat do? <laughs> well, let's like let's take a look at how everyone did with their answers. Of course, this is our five point round. Everybody's got a chance here. Of course, going backwards, Justin said a boat shaped ice tray. Brett said a uh, cube, but fine. Oh, excuse me, boat shaped I, ice cube that you put other ice cubes in and you they put water in and then you freeze it's it. It's a refreezable. Right. Oh no, I got you. It's a refreezable ice cube. There yeah. we go. Uh, Brett's gonna say a shipping container, and Brian's gonna say just a boat. He's just gonna go with boat. Yep. Nice and simple. All right, we've got your answers here, and we've got a winner. Gentlemen, take a look at your screen and see what the object is. It's a boat. It's a boat! <laughs> It's literally just a boat. Just there was the boat. nothing complicated about it. Just it was a boat the whole time. With five Dumb points, Brian Russell is your Dumb winner. Wins. Believe in dumb. Yes. Dumb wins. Brett, what did we learn this week? Well, <laughs> Jesus. Uh, 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 very quickly, though, uh, uh, if you've got an idea for a game, please send it to our email, greatnightpod at gmail.com, or in the show notes, wherever you're enjoying this. Thank you. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, what we've learned, Brian, uh, is um, that uh, uh, if you're going to jack it, it needs to be 18 inches of jacking it. That's true. We know by that law, by code law, that uh, that uh, <laughs> the best sleppy be sleppy. And and uh, we've learned that I obviously need to signal my wife when I'm making a joke just for her. <laughs> or or to or make the joke and have confidence in it instead of stopping the entire show so you can look back at your disappointment. Uh, 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 the first step is admitting you have a problem. <laughs> Still a great night. That's right. Shine on, you crazy diamond. Slamming my fingers in a door repeatedly. Motherfucking boat! The boat! The boat. Oh. It was just the same. Oh. So happy they are on a boat. You keep me alive. You help me survive. No, there's never been a greater night.
a single bed, a later night, a pause, the masturbation night, a let's get drunk and laugh tonight. There's never been a greater, great night. Diamond Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs>